Sundial growers in Tilray are absolutely soaring after hours right now. Guys, we're talking 20 plus percent gains after a 20 plus percent gain day. It is absolutely incredible how high these stocks are going. High, <laughs> no pun intended, right? Yeah, but anyway, we need to talk about why because there are there's some news that's out there right now that could potentially drive it even higher next week. Now, we need to talk about it because this could be a buy the rumor, sell the news type of deal, but we've got the, the legalization of marijuana and the cannabis industry could be, it could be growing as soon as next week. So let's discuss it. Let's talk about how much higher these stocks can go. And of course, guys, if it sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up, everybody? I'm Clay. I'm here to make 2022 the best year ever. If you haven't clicked that subscribe button, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Join us. Become a bro. We are here every single day, and we are growing our portfolios together. And look, if you're brand new to investing, you don't know how or where to buy stocks and crypto, you got a link in the description for Weeble. Super simple to set up your account. Any deposit gets you guys at least five free stocks right now. And then any $1 crypto trade gets you at least $5 in free crypto. Best promotion they ever got going on is going on right now. And then if you guys want crypto exclusive exchanges, you have those as well. We get a lot of news, a lot of big news concerning the cannabis industry and the decriminalization, not necessarily the legalization, but the decriminalization of marijuana. And that bodes extremely well for, for cannabis sector stocks. And that's what we're, that's what we are, are caring about right now. I don't really care about what these laws that are getting passed. I care about the stocks that are moving higher in price. I care about being able to make money in these stocks. And that's what the focus is on this. So wherever you guys stand on the political spectrum, this is what we're looking at next week. This bill is, they're going to be discussing some different things on it. You know, the the size and the quantity of, of the load that you can hold or whatever before it becomes a criminal possession and things like that. But the first time it did pass through the house. Now it should and most likely will pass again this time around. But the last time this happened, the cannabis industry spiked up in value, but it stalled out. This bill stalled out when it got to the Senate. So we've got some positive expectations for next week for the bill passing through the House. If it does that, we're going to need to see what happens when it gets to the Senate. But enough of that political stuff. Nobody cares about all of that. What we care about is the money. We care about the stock prices and we care about our investments. So let's talk about Sundial. Let's talk about Tilray. What they're doing right now is incredible. And do you think that this is the end of the run? No, they've got so much more room to go higher and grow high. So many good puns. Leave it alone. Leave all the puns alone in this one. But the stock prices do have a lot of room to run. Tilray currently sitting at the time of this video at $8.50 per share. Sundial sitting at $0.90. Cents. Guys, we ended the day around the $0.80 cent mark, and we were looking at the technicals. We were looking at the support and resistance lines, thinking, okay, you know what? If we break through that lower $0.80 cent level on Sundial Growers, we have got a great chance of running to 90 I mean, how many guys are in the live stream can back that up that we were talking about there above 90? We've got a dollar to a dollar 15 before we reach the next major level of resistance on sundial growers. This is huge because we're already at 90 cents after hours. The day traders are going to pick up on sundial growers in the morning and they could absolutely make it soar even higher. And of course, it makes me it makes me regret selling the shares in Sundial that I had, but it's okay because the opportunity for growth is still there. Now, here's what we need to keep in mind moving forward, though. These levels are great. We're going to have a very difficult time at that one dollar level. Very significant, and it's held up is is a lot of resistance before on Sundial growers. So you need to make sure you keep your eye on that. And, and moving forward, like I say, if it does break that dollar fifteen, it's going to be good. Here's the thing that we really need to keep in mind that's not necessarily on a technical indicator or on a technical scale. When it comes to Tilray, when it comes to Sundial, I know these are some of the most popular cannabis stocks that are out there. And there are plenty of others that are soaring as well right now. And you guys can absolutely get in them if you would like to try and take advantage of this very speculative play.
Why do I say very speculative? Sundial, Tilray, all of these cannabis stocks are moving on this decriminalization or legalization news moving forward. We've seen this before. And it worked very well for a very short period of time. You know, moving at the end of 2020 into 2021, the cannabis sector was soaring. Everybody was expecting the decriminalization with the new administration that was coming in. And it stalled out. As cannabis is very, very focused on the news. If we are not talking about it in the news, if it's not getting media attention, the stocks seem to lose steam and die back down. And we could absolutely see that happen again. The news right now is positive for the industry and positive for the growth. So if we're looking at that and all of a sudden passes the house, same situation we had before, starts to stall out, people are going to lose interest. So is this a long-term play? I'm going to leave that up to you. I think it's more of a hype play at the moment, and we've got a very nice run going on. Play it as you wish, but here's another thing that you guys need to consider as well. Even if decriminalization comes to be, you guys can see states like New York and New Jersey, it's great on the side of the law, but as soon as these big sellers want to come in, it is red tape after red tape after red tape. Looking to sell marijuana or cannabis in, in the United States may not be as easy as a lot of people think. Government, of course they want to legalize it. Why? They want to tax it. And if they want to tax it, how deep can they get their fist down inside your pocket before the industry, you know, starts to break and, and so on? It is uncharted territory. We're going to have to see how it plays out. And I do believe there's going to be a lot of red tape moving forward and a lot of bureaucracy that you have to get through before you really see these companies soar. Now, I understand all of the arguments surrounding you know, this and that on the legalization of it, and, and I don't care about those. I care about the stocks, and that's what this video is about. There's plenty of potential to make money as the industry grows and as these companies increase their revenue, increase their net profit, and all of that good stuff. So that's what we're focused on. I believe we've got a lot of growth left. Sundial growers, the next levels of resistance in mind, if it sustains these levels at 90 cents, a dollar, and the next level beyond that, a dollar 15. Plenty of money left there. Tilray, absolutely looking beautiful after hours as well right now. I want to know about you guys though. Are you in? Do you think that these stocks could absolutely boom based on this news? Get the hype going in the comments below. Let everybody know you're excited. And my gosh, the money is out there to be made right now. If this button right here is still red, make sure to click it. Subscribe to the channel. Join us. Become a bro. We are here every single day and we are growing our portfolios together. Claybro883 on Twitter and Instagram. We will finance GeminiCrypto.com. And until the next time, hope that each and every one of you have an awesome day.